go-to camera lens combo. My go-to. Go-to camera lens combo. Go-to camera lens combo. My go-to lens camera combo really depends on what my mission is. A camera lens that I can easily carry with me wherever I go. My go-to combination of camera and lens is the A7R2 and the 16 to 70 F4. A7R2 and 16 to 35. The A7R2 and the 2470 F2A Master. The A6300 with the 16 to 70 zoom lens on it. And it's, it's not big, but it's really a fabulous focal length. Well, since the RX1, why do they have so many vowels and letters and numbers? No, the RX1R2, which has its 35 millimeter fixed lens, is my favorite camera. You know, the camera that I've always got with me when I'm traveling is my RX1R Mark II. 24 to 72 a G Master and A7R2. That's really my workhorse. And having that little option of where I'm looking down like this and looking up at my subject and looking down, it takes the, the picture just even down half a foot, makes a huge difference to my image making. And it also, it takes the camera out in front of my face. My go-to lens and camera combination is going to be the A7R2 and the 55mm Zeiss lens. I love the 55 because it's a small lens that's super compact, but yet it goes really low in its f-stop. So it can give me what I love about the 85 millimeter, but it's just not as big. It's more compact. The 8514 from Sony with the uh, Sony A7R2. For a majority of my uh, professional portrait work, that's that's it. In addition to the 2470, I, probably the next lens that I'd use would be the 8514 G Master. It's definitely going to be either my 5014 or my 8514 at this point with my A7R2. The A7R Mark II with its uh, wonderful 42 megapixels of resolution and crazy dynamic range, mixed in probably with the 16 to 35 F4 FE. It's a wonderful setup, it's light, it's portable, and I can pretty much take it anywhere. But I'm also a huge fan, especially for my video work, of the RX10 series. For landscapes, it's gonna be my A7R2, and it's gonna be the, the 24 to 70. You know what I really like about the high megapixel count of the A7R Mark II? for me at least, is the latitude that I get in post-production with it. Definitely right now the A7R2 and the G Master 24-70. It's so sweet. I don't want to give it up, so I love it.